what we have to remember is that fundamentally, this is getting a little bit philosophical, but the way AI works and the way chat GPT can work is based on big data. When we talk about big data, we talk about all the data that's out in the world online. It consumes it, it can draw on it, and it can generate stuff from it. That is not how our brains work. So however it looks like it's emergent intelligence, it will always be fundamentally different to the way our human chemistry and biology works. That's an important thing to remember. The same way if you talk about AI or machine learning in terms of the supercomputers that could beat humans at chess, right? They aren't playing chess in the same way as the human. They are running thousands and millions of combinations of potential moves incredibly quickly. But how many moves can a human make in the head, even the best? Not that many. There's a fundamental different approach. And that's actually what's quite magical about the human brain in that it can still do those things and actually compete and actually be better than something that's looking at so much data.